to ADTC tonight. Our returning champs are breaking it down live to honor DoSomething.org's inspirational young activists. All right, next up is We Are Heroes, who achieved their dream of becoming our first all-female champ in season four. So let's see how they teamed up with a girl who's proven that people with disabilities can also live up to their dreams. We Are Heroes is back. Going back on the show and dancing, I think it's just so dope because it's not just for myself or for these girls, but it's for a cause. I'm Sarah Kronk, I live in Bettendorf, Iowa, and I'm a junior at Pleasant Valley High School. Is everyone going to some really Yeah, and we actually had a competition this year. I started a special needs cheer squad called Spartan Sparkles to inspire and empower high school cheerleaders to start squads for students with disabilities. Come on, heroes! I think the sparkles have really helped all the kids at my school and the faculty and the community to see the person and not the disability. It's opening their minds and hearts to a whole other group of people. And so we wanted to grow that nationwide and get squads started all across the country. And that's why we created the Sparkle Effect. What's your favorite thing about being in Sparkle? It's when we go on trips and get even more famous, sir. <laughs> Please welcome We Are Heroes. I'm super happy that we were paired with We Are Heroes because we're really all about girl power with the sparkles. I really hope when people hear about the sparkle effect, they'll be inspired to be more socially inclusive. It can be inviting someone to sit with you at lunch, smiling at someone in the hallway. Giving so little of yourself can make such a huge impact in someone else's life. Sarah, you showed us what a true hero is, and we're going to do this for you, girl. Leading the charge to support special needs kids with a performance dedicated to Sarah Cronk's The Sparkle Effect, here's our season four champion, We Are Heroes. What you thought of the ladies? Now, it's one thing to just pop out of a box, but when you could pop out of a box and dance like that, you're saying something. Listen, we are heroes. Y'all always turn it up. Y'all always turn it up. And, and I just want to congratulate you guys for being the first female crew to be champions on this show. World, world talk. Um, let's get into a slow Michelle, it's a mess. Catwoman. Listen, let's get into a slow mo right quick of um, Ali and Michelle doing these tumbles. They are on time. They are powerful. And that's real girl power right there. Speaking of which, you know, Sarah's charity is all about, you know, the sparkle effect is all about giving people power and inspiration. You know what I'm saying? And, and taking people who are disabled and letting them know you don't have to give up on your dreams. And to just keep going and move far in life. And that's. That's irreplaceable. Y'all did y'all thing for y'all charity. 
Thank you, Sarah, for everything that you're doing in your community. And thank you, We Are Heroes. You are truly that. <laughs> thank you, Lil Mama. And now, We Are Heroes is going to make a special presentation to the Sparkle Effect. So let's bring Sarah Kronk up on stage so Nichelle can hand out a gift of $10,000 for her organization. Man, Sarah. Man, Sarah, we had such an amazing time with you and the cheerleaders. So we just want to give this to you so you can keep up all your great work. Thank you. Everybody, let's get up for Sarah. Michelle, you should wear that every day. <laughs> thank you, Sarah. She's funny, too. And thank you, We Are Heroes. Coming up, Hawk and the Hip Hop Warriors from Quest Crew hit the stage for the first time since they locked down the crown. And later, the legendary crew that started a movement, Jabberwockies, is back to blow your minds. ABDC, it's live.